Hi everyone, my name is Christopher Walker and today we're going to be talking about how to filter your emails. So first what you're going to do is you're going to come up towards the top and you're actually going to do the same thing that we did with advanced search. So you're going to click on the drop down arrow and you'll notice that it's the same screen. And in this case, I'm going to filter all of my emails from um, this person. Now, what it's going to do, instead of clicking down here, clicking search um, and searching for those emails, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create a filter. So I'm gonna click here. Now, when you create a filter, you have a couple options. So one is that you can skip your inbox completely. So if you know that this person sends you things that you really don't want to be looking at, um, maybe it's promotions and stuff like that, you can skip the inbox and send it, send it directly to your archive so you don't even have to read it. You can mark them as read. Um, if it, their stuff is really important, maybe it's your boss, you can star it automatically. You can even pick um, where you want it to go as far as a label. Um, you can forward it to maybe a different email address or someone else, delete it, um, never send it to spam. So if you notice that this person's stuff is going to spam a lot, you can do this as an option so that it never gets sent there. Um, and then you, so you have a, other different options down here as well. Once you're ready, you're going to create filter. So I'm gonna do, um, this one as star it, create that filter, and it's going to, from now on, star all the emails sent from that person. Now, you can also do this um, within an email. So if I go here, um, this is an email that I received. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here to the three vertical dots, and I'm going to click on filter messages like this. And it's going to pop open that screen again. And now this time it's auto um, put in the the from because this is the same person it was from. Um, so it remade it so that now all of those messages from that same email sender are in here. And then I can create a filter this way. So two different options, but both are great ways to set up a filter within your Gmail account. <laughs>